Hello, long time no see. Okay, so I have decided to look at the 3D 3D photo in painting. I already I already made a video about this, but uh, I used 3D photo in paint in painting in uh, uh, in Google Collab. Uh, which is user friendly but not super user friendly especially compared to hugging face so now i'm in hugging face and i clicked on spaces and in the search box i started clicking 3d photo in painting but that 3d photo as you can see you don't have much of a choice so you get this guy not used much 25 25 hearts so Let's try it out. It should be the same as the Google Collab. Okay. So, yeah, so you put your image here, you can select number of frames. It's going to generate it's going to generate a depth map and it's going to generate a um, like a movie wiggle thing. Uh, the FPS, okay, fine. Examples, okay. So let's try that. We're gonna try it on two images. I got from Pixabay, one easy, one harder. Let's try the easy, the easier one of the two. So, uh, okay, okay. So let's try that one. So this is this young lady. Uh, it's easy because uh, the the subject of interest is very well defined and basically anything else is blurred so it should be very easy in theory so uh, okay so the current runtime is around 400 to 700 700 seconds so i'm assuming it's running on the cpu so it takes about 10 minutes so I'm going to start it and I'll be back when it's done so that you don't have to wait like I do. Okay, so I'm just going to submit and wait. Okay, looks like it's done. So it took, it didn't, it didn't take that long actually, 2.30. Uh, Uh, yeah, it's good, but, uh, yeah, there was another one, another 3D image in painting space in hugging face that would give you also the death map. Hmm. I can't find it anymore, but anyway, okay, so that's your, let's see if I can do it full screen yeah so uh, what what did I want to say yeah so the depth map is probably uh, quite correct except maybe here yeah and as you can see when you do the the movie, the background is always fixed. It's the foreground that moves the most. Uh, and if you watch my other video on 3D photo in painting, the one uh, in Google Collab, I think I made one where I show how to get uh, views, I mean a movie that goes left and right, that's it very easy you have to modify uh, one file and then you can get a movie so that it goes from left to right and from there if you use like avid mux you can uh, you can extract the views and you can make a lenticular i actually did that once once or twice the problem is that whatever you do the background is always fixed and the foreground moves which is not good because then 
the subject of interest, which is usually the foreground, uh, is blurry under the lenticular lens. So that's not so good for lenticular. But that's the way it is, I guess. Alright, so let's try something else. Yeah, the, the other one that would give you the depth map was actually slower than this one, but it looks the same though. I don't know. Okay. Well, let's stick with that one. But I know that there is another one that also gives you give you the depth map, if you're interested. Okay, so let's try another one. All right, so let's put one that's harder. Okay. Yeah, I don't know if you can see very well, but it's like a a shop in a bazaar or something, and you have all those lanterns. Those are in the foreground. All those lanterns going. So this is the foreground. This is more. This is more back. You have this guy. So I suspect this one is going to be harder. But let's see. Let's just submit and wait. And I'll be right back. Okay, it's done. It's 261 seconds. So that's good. Um, yep. So let's see. Full screen. Yeah. Oh, yeah. So now you can see this. So you see this is foreground, foreground, foreground. Well, now you can this I don't know what that is so anyway let's see what happens yeah it's not bad yeah, in the end of at the end of the day it's not the greatest picture uh, it's always better to have the the foreground in the middle instead of on the side. You know what I'm saying? So not the greatest. But it does work. I mean if you look at my other video I I must have tried like half a dozen pictures and it works pretty well in general okay so i think i think i'm gonna stop here i'll put a link to this guy yeah so i was telling you that i thought there was another one but when i when i put like in painting like even in paint, I don't see anything else. This, that's the one I just did. This, I don't even know what that is. FCF. Yeah. I mean, if it's only two likes. Okay. Yeah, I mean, you can try all this stuff. I mean, there's so many possibilities in Paint Me. Okay, so it seems there's only one 3D photo in painting in all of Hugging Face. So that must be the one. I wonder okay let me just try to check something maybe it's uh... or oh, DPT DPT something maybe it's that one of those uh, let me try that one. Okay, so yeah, you get the depth. Mm. 
Oh, you can even 3D point cloud. Nice. Okay, so let's take an example just to see. Just to see. Okay, so that's one. And I just wanted to try... Uh, yeah, so that one... I'll just check this one. Or this one. You see that one? No, I don't think it's that one. But this one. No. This one just gives you a dev map. Yeah, that I know that. So it's not that one. It's not that one, which is the same. So that one gives you a dev map. Oh, it gives you also a 3D mesh reconstruction. That's pretty cool. Yeah. So you can do stuff. That's pretty nice. Uh, okay. Okay. So, okay. So I'm going to stop here. So uh, please like, comment, subscribe. Uh, and of course, the more likes and comments and subscriptions I get, the more motivated I am. For making new videos okay so i'll stop here see you around bye